Are you serious? Yes. No, are we serious? Yes. Say it again. I broke up with you. Okay. Listen, I don't know if this is fake or not, but if I was in his place, I would do the same. It's just annoying behavior in my opinion. How long have you guys been dating for? I'm assuming you're a couple? Um, dude, we just passed seven months, so. You trust each other? Yeah. All right, so today we're going to be swapping telephones and looking through different things. We're like busy looking at stuff right now. We're not really in a time crunch or anything, so I don't see why it's a problem. Okay, you guys got time. So swap phones. Yeah. All right. How's he looking? He's looking good. Nothing weird? Nothing so far. All right. Really? Matt? No. You're literally texting Matt again. Wait, who's Matt? That's her ex. You're going crazy. I think... No, we're not. I'm not hanging out with Matt. I'm looking at the screen, and it says, I'm leaving my boyfriend's house in 10 minutes. Do you want to hang out? I think you're just being controlling. You think I'm being controlling? Because yeah. I won't let you hang out with your ex? He's just a friend. Okay, well, yeah. guess what? I know a little someone named Olivia Rodrigo, and she has something to say to you. Betrayed me. We can talk about this no, later. we can't work this. Yeah, out. you guys work that one out. Um, you betrayed him. You're a traitor. Let's go. I'm leaving. You betrayed me. This is obviously a skip, but she got caught red-handed. If you find out that she's cheating, send her back where she belongs. females lie about their body count. We're lying about it because y'all care about it so much. That's the only reason why we have to lie is because we're competing with these other bitches who haven't had as much sex as us and guys find that more attractive. So then we gotta be like, oh shit. I haven't slept uh. with that many people. I use the word insecure as some type of coping mechanism for men who actually care about the type of woman that they pursue a relationship with. Oh, you don't want me wearing this? You're so insecure. Oh, you don't want me going out late with my friends to the club at night? You're so insecure within yourself. Sis, that's not insecurity. That's love and protection. That man knows how visual men are. Why would he want his woman to be a target to other men? Why would he want your private area, something that only his eyes are supposed to see, on display for the whole world to see? See, the problem is you want the freedom of acting single all while while still being in a relationship with someone. You want all the benefits, but expect him to just do everything that you say and just roll with it. You expect him to defend you. You expect him to protect and provide for you. But when he does it in a way that's not how you want, it's a problem. If he didn't love you, he wouldn't set up boundaries for you, sis. If he let you go out and do what you want to do, wear what you want to wear, staying up late all hours of night, he wouldn't give a damn about you, knowing very well the dangers that are out there. What's the craziest thing ever did? Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. One time I had a three-way with these two guys in college and my sorority sisters were like cheering me. What about you, sir? <laughs> Crazy thing I ever did. Can I show my They'd probably be having a little gangbang here without a rub. <laughs> done, man. This thing is old. Wait a minute, hold, hold. Wait, hold. I, I'm kidding. I'm, 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 That's right, bro. Leave her on that day by herself. It's probably the best decision that you ever made. And she should have not opened her mouth about this in the first place. She just ruined everything. Did you um sleep with him or just kiss him? I slept with him. Okay, fine. For like 10 seconds. And then I stopped it and I came straight back to you. I don't know, maybe this was just one crazy moment before us. Because I love you, Joshua. I love you. That's not love. That's guilt. Love is trust. No, it is. That's all it is. That's the only currency. And you broke no, it. No, it isn't. This isn't your website, man. A festo. Love is lots of things. It's me. Oh. No, yeah, I could see that. Wait, what? Yeah, well, you said it's not you, it's me. And by me, it, you meant you, like implying it was your fault, which I totally get. Okay, I was just saying that to be polite. Exactly. You're a liar. You just lied to me. And honesty is the foundation of a healthy relationship. You know what? I don't even know what to say to you right now. Exactly, because you have poor interpersonal communication skills, which is why we can't communicate well, hence why the relationship's not working, which is why I agree when you said it's your fault and not mine. You're a horrible boyfriend. Ah, 
was a horrible boyfriend because as of about 20 seconds ago, you broke up with me. So that's how that works. Ha <laughs> ha. Got my copy. Gotta stay caffeinated. Listen, this is obviously fake, but she got outsmarted by logic. You love to see it. She was trying like to manipulate and gaslight him, but he was not letting that shit slide. Would you cheat for a thousand dollars? That's a lot of money. Oh. I would. Oh. I like that. No explanation, no asking why. Just peace out. Hey, Nisha. Oh. Who's this? It's my brother. You, you get your hands on him, though? No, Who's you, boss? Uh, Come here, let me talk to you. Why you, why you, why you, why you behind him? Hey, watch out, boss. What's wrong with this camera? Bro, bro, just, first of all, just stay out with what the f you got going on, bro. Who, matter of fact, who was you? Because I'm her man. Where y'all supposed to be going? Speak up, spit it out. Let, let me hear what you gotta say. Because you got the wrong one today. Get the f out at this point, bro. Get the f out. I thought I could put up with your shit, but I can't. Exactly, bro. If she's being annoying and being extra all of the time, don't put up with her bullshit. Just tell her to leave. Just like this. No man wants to deal with a combative, argumentative woman. Yet. No, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Tell me about yourself. Okay, I'm Gabrielle. Give each other a chance. Yeah, let's okay. give each other a chance. Let's, let's, yeah, let's okay, you want to do that? I do see you as a friend. No! Yeah, just leave. Leave. You took the L. That was just embarrassing. It was funny how she was trying to explain, oh, I do see you as a friend. Bam! Get the fuck out of here. Woman gets humbled in five seconds. Damn, that was quick. What is happening? Short. Oh. You just broke up with your boyfriend in front of me. Uh-huh. I got news for you, Red. What's... Why you say it like that? You said it all. What's wrong? Right? You're a gold digger. <laughs> you are a gold digger. <laughs> no, I'm... A what? You're a gold digger. I... And I'm literally, like, confused <laughs> because you just broke up with your boyfriend for no reason. You broke up with your boyfriend to be single. I broke up with my boyfriend to be single. What do you say? Yes. So we're not like it's no longer. No, I would never. How you gonna make me break up? Why would you let me do that if you know that you wasn't? Yo, you're crazy. I'm, I'm a crazy. gold digger. How am I gold digger? Because of everything you just did out there. You told me you weren't interested. <laughs> you all said of that. that didn't matter. What do you mean it didn't you said matter? It didn't matter. How you gonna hold that against me? And, and if you, you look right it... there, though, look right there. It's a small pen, and I'm catching gold diggers. And this is on YouTube, and this is on gonna be everywhere. You exposed. <laughs> it's, but it's hard for me to even really take this shit serious, though, because, like, you just, I don't know, goofy. <laughs> you goofy, bro. You just broke up with your boyfriend for somebody you didn't even know. You just got me a goofy. Think about it. No, just, I need you to go home and literally think about what you did. Because now you single, and now you don't have nobody. Hey, she did that boyfriend of a favor. Because why would he be with someone that only wants him for money? You see? You play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. I can do this. I can Babe. Do this. Babe. Oh my god. Babe. 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 Look what you've done. Babe. Bro! Bro! Babe! 
So I guess this was like a loyalty test and she chose the car over him. I mean, if she's gonna choose the car, then stay with the car. That man made his mind up. He doesn't want to be with you anymore. Fellas, never set yourself on fire to keep someone else's wall. Ustedes como pareja se dejarían por algo material o dinero? Nah. No. ¿Qué tal que si te regalo la Mercedes, lo dejarías? Pero escúchame, tuvieras que besar a mi amigo para comprobar que lo has dejado. ¿Pero en serio por la Mercedes? Sí, sí, sí. Es una oportunidad. Es una oportunidad única, pues. Dile que lo has terminado, pues. Dile que lo has terminado. Y a las tres. A la madre. Pues te vamos a enseñar por acá la Mercedes para que vengas a, para que el público mire que esto es cierto. Yo le prometí la Mercedes se le va a dar. A ver, permíteme. A la cuenta de tres. Vas a ver tu Mercedes. Ahí está, un aplauso por mamá. Aquí está tu Mercedes. Sorry. That was aggressive slam, no worries. I'm so sorry. You're lovely. Thank you. Um, but yes. Was it the Riverdale? I'm gonna be very candid with you. We have a little bit of a bromance back there, and so I kind of did it for the boys. Hey, bros before hoes, man. That's the motto. Can you smell my hands? Oh, did it taste like money? <laughs> Absolutely. Oh my God, well, can I kiss your hand? It tastes like poverty. <laughs> oh my God. God damn, this crib is fat. Baby, I'm here to... Hi. Who the f is that? Oh, that's my guy's best friend. Where are you going? Nah, we ain't about that. Guy best friend, red flag. Run, run, run for your life. Listen, if she's on her phone while on a date, that's just disrespectful. Because why would you be on a date if you're gonna stay on your phone all of the time? And honestly, don't even show up to the date and let the man enjoy the meal by himself. 